the neutron number of here so they has interchange mathematically in nature it is seen that so they uh, these two uh, isobars will call the mirror isobar of one another these two isobar will call the mirror isobar of one another radioactivity is a very easy chapter just mathematically think and few knowledge you need to do other things are very easy next one next question is number 5 who has discovered the phenomena of radioactivity obviously henry barkwell discovered the phenomena of radioactivity coming to the next question number 6 that is radioactivity is a nuclear phenomena why explain see we know radioactivity is a nuclear phenomena but why because most of the cases uh, maximum radioactivity is all about neutron proton ratio means suppose i am having a atom atoms uh, mass number and proton number i know that is uh, sorry uh, suppose i am having a atom so this is its mass number this is its atomic number so what will be the number of proton p equal to z exactly equal to same and number of neutron will be a minus z number of neutron will be a minus z nothing uh, problem is there so if most of the cases again telling most of the cases when you will study the same radioactivity chapter in class 12 or uh, class 12 you can see there are some uh, exceptions also so right now just i am letting you know if neutron by proton ratio is greater than 1.5 if neutron if for a atom is neutron by proton ratio is greater than 1.5 that atom will show the neutron uh, radioactivity uh, phenomena now whenever there is a radioactivity phenomena is occurring we can see um, if i am changing um i am changing physical property suppose what suppose pressure temperature that will not affect the radioactivity of the substance that will not affect the radioactivity of the substance but uh, and also if the i am changing the chemical property suppose taking part in oxidation reduction that does not change that the emission or the radioactivity is raised so means what uh, the outer most electrons outer most electron of the atom does not take part in the radioactivity and the bottom line the outer most electron does not take part in radioactivity who is taking part in the radioactivity the uh, proton neutron which present in the atom a uh, proton or neutron present in the atom where protons or neutrons belong to in the nucleus so radioactivity is completely a nuclear phenomena answer given in the pdf still i am explaining so radioactivity is a completely nuclear phenomena in books also this answer given okay now coming for the next one number 7 define alpha emission with nuclear equation means i need to define alpha emission with the respect to uh, with respect to a um, uh, uh, equation suppose i am having a unstable nuclei what i say unstable nuclei and radioactive nuclei both are same so if neutron by proton ratio is more than 1.5 that will emit uh, alpha beta or gamma ray or that will taking part any kind of radioactivity decay so if a number of uh, in a, if in a nucleus there is more number of neutron with respect to proton means neutron by proton ratio is greater than 1.5 it may emit it may emit beta particle it may emit alpha particle since question is belongs uh, about alpha particle so i am saying that it may emit a particle containing which containing two protons and uh, two protons and two neutrons means whatever may be the particle will emit alpha particle that having mass number 2 plus 2 equal to 4 and atomic number only 2 clear this kind of particle when emit okay first of all this that particle obviously should bound to the nucleus otherwise how could it emit so if they imagine containing two protons and two neutrons
neutron which bound tightly with the neutrons then that particle is called alpha ray means whenever suppose this is the parent nuclei who is parent nuclei who is from whom the uh, radiation occurs so this is parent nuclei from parent nuclei alpha particle emits so if alpha particle emits so new nucleus suppose this is y whose mass number will be decreased by 4 and atomic number will decrease by 2 whose mass number will be decreased by 4 and atomic number will be decreased by 2 remember and so uh, and one alpha particle is emitting alpha particle generally in retain as in terms of helium alpha particle generally retain as in terms of any uh, helium so when you are alpha particle emission i am saying that will be the definition and this equation must must you have to give otherwise you will get a big zero acha coming for next one uses of radio uh, what are the uses of radioactive isotope see in book concise physics books there are there are too many uses given okay saying what are the uses what you will read medical uses scientific uses industrial uses so these three uses are very important all the three uses you need to learn within that any two uses you will give so in um, uh, a bit of suggest page number 292 nothing new in that you just go through that books so you will get the things what you need to give regarding that radioactive uh uses of radioactive isotope so page number 292 is enough for radioactive isotope next one concise physics written there concise physics page number 292 next one see question number 9 it is given there few equation given that equation i need to solve solve means there are some blank portion given that in that blank portion what will be the answer so let's 